Well, the on-air shooting of a reporter and a photojournalist in Virginia hits close to home. Yeah, tonight, investigators are searching for a reason why Vester Flanagan, a former employee at the TV station, targeted his victims, Allison Parker and Adam Ward. Carity on News Channel 13's Rana Novini gives us an insight into what the victims were like from the perspective of the newsroom. And Rana, people at that TV station obviously grieving the loss and like the rest of us, wondering why this happened. Yeah, absolutely. And the shooter used to be part of that news team. Vester Flanagan is described as an angry man who was fired as a reporter at that station, but the former co workers never believed his firing would lead to, lead to this. They worked as a team every morning. Adam and I work the same early morning shift, but have completely different sleep schedules, covering everything from breaking news. Photojournalist Adam Ward and I are putting the final touches on our special report to stories about community events. During their last report, a live interview about tourism, a gunman opened fire, killing reporter Allison Parker and photojournalist Adam Ward. We're all in a state of shock here. You can hear people behind us in the newsroom crying. The gunman. We'll just have to wait until later today when Chatham County voters go to the polls. Seen Vester here on his own resume reel is Zoom. Vester Flanagan, who went by Bryce Williams when he worked as a reporter at the same news station. I can't figure out any connection uh, with those people who were among the, the, the kindest, nicest people who worked here. Police say Flanagan shot and killed himself when confronted by authorities on a Virginia interstate. It's really hard to even comprehend. Adam Ward was 27 years old. And just that morning, WBDJ was celebrating him and his fiance, a producer for the same station. The couple was moving to a new city together. Instead, she watched from the control room as her fiance was killed. Allison had brought in balloons, I brought in a cake. It was a day of celebration. Allison Parker was 24 years old, described as a passionate journalist. Her boyfriend also worked at the station as an anchor. And the woman they were interviewing this morning was also shot, but she's okay, listed in stable condition. Reporting live in studio, Rana Novini, KRDO News Channel 13.